Yes. And you grew up in California. Yes. And you grew up in Cerritos, which yes. has the largest auto mall. Yes, it does. The Cerritos Auto Square. But I've heard Cerritos Auto Square. See that jingle? That jingle gets to everybody. Yes. And that's the only way people know where Cerritos is. Because, well, you see all the dealerships when you drive on the when freeway, you drive by. right? Exactly. And you exactly. owned a dealership. I did. I used to own a, 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 a two Hyundai dealerships. How yeah. did you get into that? Or do so, you just have to when you live in Cerritos? You're just like, well, yeah, they make the you. Business. Yeah, so you you can't graduate from high school oh, unless you own a Okay. That makes sense. That makes sense. <laughs> no, so um, uh, a friend of mine, uh, I went to an award show for some uh, for minority dealers, and uh, they were talking to me about getting into the business. So I said, hey. So I had to go to, to dealer school and everything, and I got into the business. And my mentor from the auto dealership got me the suit. <laughs> so uh, that's one thing I got out of it. I got, I got two failed dealerships and a suit. <laughs> Were you so you were selling cars at you yes, had your own so, dealership? Yes, yeah, so I was, so with the car dealership, it's it's really hard to be an absentee. Chestnut owner. Hyundai, it said. Well, no, I didn't want to do Chestnut. <laughs> I didn't want to. Do, well, see, actually, so um, it was it was I was I got very lucky. So when I first I had a partner when I first started out, and we were trying to figure out some advertising, and so we had a meeting with a couple of different um, companies that were going to advertise for us. And during this meeting with the whole team, um, the team was saying, "Hey, you know what? You should really put you know Chestnut on the dealership." And I was like, okay, I said, I'm open to that. So about, so the meeting ended, and about an hour after that, the guy who was trying to solicit our business to advertise, he called me. And he said, listen, he says, um, I know you're new to this business. He says, and I know I could lose a huge contract, but you should really think twice about putting your name on dealership, and you should not do it. And that was the best information that he's ever given me. Wow. Yeah, that was, that was great. So have you ever gone to now back to a dealership to get a car, and now you know too much? You know the game. <laughs> I mean, I would really love to go try to buy a car with you. Yeah, you know, it's, it's the thing. See, I've never personally, so the only new cars, I, I bought my mother a new car, I bought my, 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 uh, my wife a new cars. I don't buy new cars. I've always bought used cars. Okay, yeah. I like that. Like I like that. Cars? You no, no, not son. vintage because you know it's it's. Um, I don't really want to say this. I know a lot of dealers, <laughs> but you'll probably get more value if yeah. you don't buy a brand new car. I'll Got say it. that. All right. Okay.